I'm Fiona McCallion and I hope you enjoy finding out what you can tell from handwriting. In this video, we're going to look at goals. How you set your goals. How big a leap will you take? And the goals show in the lowercase t. And it doesn't matter how you write your t, whether you write it in script, whether you print it, whether you do something with a loop, it doesn't matter. So long as it's a T, all we're looking at is the crossbar. So look at your T's, the crossbar, and follow through. If you make your T crossbar low, that is about the level of the top of the lowercase letters or below, then you set yourself safe goals. You say to yourself, one step at a time gets me there, and go off and take one step at a time. You may be extremely successful and get a very long way up the ladder, but you take one step at a time. If you make your T crossbar higher, it's half, approximately halfway up, it's not right at the bottom and it's not right at the top, then you set practical goals. Your motto is, I can reasonably expect to get there. So you're stretching yourself a bit more, but you still looking at practical what I can reasonably expect to achieve. As your T-bar gets higher, you'll now see it's on the very top. It's still connected. It's still touching. It's on the very top of the T. It's distant goals. If I take one giant leap, I can make it in one go. So that's really ambitious goals stuck on the very top of the T. Now, guess what this one is? The T bar is floating above the T up in the air. It means you're a dreamer, goals in the clouds. When you wish upon a star. It's all very well to have some dreams, but don't have them all dreams. You won't get very far if everything you have is just a dream. So here are all the T's. The low T bar is safe goals. The middle T-bar is practical goals, the high T-bar is distant goals, and the T-bar way off at the top is the dreamer. It's perfectly normal to have a variety of T-bars in your writing. It just means you've got different goals in different areas. And if you write about one specific thing, read what you're writing about and see the T-bars. You'll see the goals for that specific area. So that's your goals. This is practical handwriting analysis, right on. Job fit. Don't just choose a job, choose the right job. Discover your most marketable skills and aptitudes as shown in your handwriting. Yes, in your handwriting. Identify your career type. Find ideas to fit with who you are and what you love to do. It includes tips and tactics on checking out training and employment prospects. Your writing shows what types of work you will enjoy the most. It shows your abilities and your talents. So if you're still wondering what work to do next, this book can help you in a unique but very effective way. Don't just find a job, choose the right job. Find out how with this fun and fascinating book. To read more, click the link below in the description box.